Hello and welcome back. In this lecture, we will be learning about Microsoft Azure Germany specific data center regions. We will be exploring some of the advantages that we have uh, with these German data centers. In our last lesson, we looked at Azure government services is and we saw how it is typically separated isolated instance of Azure just for the government. Well, Azure Germany services is much as the same as your government uh, in that regards but it's a physically isolated definitely it is a physically isolated instance of Azure cloud spread uh, spread out across two different regions within the Microsoft uh, within the Germany and now you might be wondering why exactly is there is a separate cloud for Germany well we have looked in the past lessons uh, about the GDPR uh, which is a European uh, Union uh, regulation providing laws around and how you uh, resident data is stored well Germany laws are actually kind of extend upon that and in general when it comes to data protection and security Germany is one of the most heavily regulated countries in the world now with uh, now in conjunction with the GDPR and uh, German regulator regulations require that all the personal data of Germany be stored in Germany and owned by a German company and so in order to meet this requirement Microsoft partner with Germany companies uh, and they built two uh, distincts of data centers in Germany only part of Azure and they handed control of the data to those German companies and again in order to uh, comply with the regulators like customer data and related uh, system uh, resides in the Germany in order to meet strict European Union requirements Microsoft gave control to German uh, data or uh, trustees and now any organization that doing business within the European Union or maybe in the UK or maybe um, anywhere within the EU especially dealing with the German citizens uh, can now utilize these Azure uh, uh, for specific to the German services in order to uh, comply with these strict laws possible but the but unfortunately these are uh, no more uh, uh, no more offering any of the new logins for Microsoft Azure Germany that means they have actually discontinued uh, the specific to the German changes but maybe you know you may be wondering why I'm talking here even though this was uh, discontinued because uh, the problem is in case if you're getting in the exam about these things I you might needs to be no aware of this because this also scoped within the Microsoft AZ900 exam. So I hope this is useful for you. Uh, thank you for watching this.